Ready? Go! Something I want to try, actually. Uh, it didn't work all that well. Okay. This is going to be really, really stupid. But it worked for me the last time, so I'm going to do it again. So I'm just going to put this on times two, to be honest. Because it's, it's literally this. He can't, like I said in the, um, the pilot episode during boss survival, he can't get to you. He has to do that each time. He usually would go up there and throw knives at you and it's an insta-kill. You know, because he's a jackass. But, for some reason, lying here, you'd think he could be able to just throw a knife at you, but no. For some reason, he just can't hit you. He's a weirdo. Don't really understand it, but it is what it is. swims around and then he'll approach you, walk at you. That there orange thing around him, uh, it's he's, in, he's actually invincible. So if you actually try to attack him with any other attack, he will not do any damage. I don't really want to prove it because if he gets too close he can insta-kill you. Practically every attack that he does is an insta-kill. He just comes over and literally stabs you. You're dead insulin. This is the one fight in the game that, honestly, I had no fear about. Mostly because of this strategy. Just hit him in the shin over and over again. Man forgot to wear shin pads today. And, to be honest, there's a problem. See if you do this properly, um, I've never actually honestly seen anybody do this other than this, but if you probably did this the correct way, he would probably be the most annoying boss. 